I got some bad news for you folks, and this is coming from somebody that absolutely loves America and loves this country, and is that America seems weaker than ever in the eyes of the world right now. I think that what a lot of people don't realize is that when America does stupid stuff, when we have stupid racial protests, or when we have um, arguments about pronouns, or when we put out cartoon ads for recruitment in the United States military that are all about um, a recruit having two mommies, or when we, um, you know, put these freak shows in and out of the Oval Office. Remember, the guy that is supposed to be in charge of our nuclear waste is, is running around with people on dog leashes and wearing dresses and all of that stuff. You have to understand that the enemies of the world and the really bad actors of the world are watching every single thing that comes from this country every single day. And I've got to say, that for the better part of a year, ever since Biden took office, the image that America has been betraying to the world is an image of weakness. It is an image of absolute cartoonishness. And the wolves of the world took notice. And this is why um, Vladimir Putin has reacted to um, Ukraine with such aggression because he knows that America is weak right now. Remember, he did the same thing back in 2014 um, when it comes to him sort of trying to encroach on other countries. So this is what happens when the weakness of America and our leaders is given center stage when it comes to how the world sees us. So when the military is less focused on recruitment and more focused on kicking people out that decide to not get a vaccine that has a uh, from uh, COVID that has a 99.9% recovery rate, when we've got the generals in the military going on television and talking about their quote unquote white rage because they know that is the way the political winds are blowing. When we see the United States military standing down quote unquote for extremism in our ranks, by the way, the world sees that stuff. They see weakness, and when the wolves of the world see weakness, they absolutely pounce. That is why you see this increased aggression from Vladimir Putin. That is why you see the border that we have on our southern border gone absolutely crazy and unchecked with all sorts of people and drugs and smuggling flowing through it. America right now is projecting nothing but weakness to the world, and we have to start projecting strength.